Hi friends, Doc South here, and yeah, I know, I kind of lackadaisical today. Uh, this is not my most enthusiastic, power-filled present, not the most uh, power-filled presentation I've ever done, but oh my God, what a day at work. Oh, yeah, yeah. We got Christmas, what, in two days now, I think, right? About two days. And uh, we've been, oh my gosh, we've just been, well, I work for a supermarket, as many of you know. And uh, we've just been oh so busy. And day after day after day, uh, people getting food by the buckets. And, and you know, that's good. I'm, I'm kind of glad that we're there, that we're there for people. Tell you the truth, I wouldn't have it any other way. But, boy, you do come home whooped. And I, I was looking at the calendar, and I think I've got, let's see, i got tomorrow, i got to work Christmas, uh, then I think... And Saturday, and I bet I got to work Sunday. Yeah, I think I got about another four days to go. And I, I believe I've been working already about three or so. Yeah, all leaves are canceled. Let's put it that way. <laughs> and uh, darn near, anyhow. And oh my gosh, it is. I'll tell you the truth. If you want to, here I am, 74 years old now. 74, yes, yeah, older than dirt. And uh, I got to say, I'm in pretty darn good shape for all the lugging and stomping around and uh, the work I do. It's um, I highly recommend it if you can, you know, if you don't mind uh, a good workout every day. But other than that, boy, it's um, fighting this COVID thing has been, woo, is the best I can say. There, that's it. Woo. <laughs> We've been so doggone busy right from the get go. I mean, remember back when everything first uh, broke that the uh, virus was around and very dangerous and people were buying food, you know, toilet paper was flying out like, you know, like it almost looked like an express train going out the door. Uh, water, uh, of course, staple foods, foods you could eat without cooking, that kind of thing. Oh, my gosh, everybody and people were going nuts. Plus, they were kind of ill at ease to be in the store. Uh, you know, any any store, but especially a supermarket, they're usually kind of tight quarters, and uh, it was tough. And like I said, uh, I, I was the guy for a lot of the time, uh, many a day, I was the guy out front saying, sir, you got to put a mask on. <laughs> and uh, some people, oh, yeah, sorry, I yes, let me get my mask. And, uh, and then others, what do you mean I got to wear them? Yeah, so things were... Yeah, it was it was uh, it was interesting. It was a workout, mental workout, um, and all the while, you know, all my uh, coworkers just when a load came, man, we jumped on it, got it on the shelves, and uh, I think did our best to treat everybody uh, nicely. And so I'm kind of proud of the people I work with. I got to tell you, I am. They're they're good people, um, <clears throat> and um, the nice thing I think is is. I've always liked, whenever I could, I've always liked trying to serve. Um, I I know I wasn't in the Navy very long, but I liked being there. I helped my guys uh, in in uh, my boot camp company, uh, help them with their lessons to get them into this, uh, you know, to, to get them through boot camp. Um, uh, the, um, I enjoyed, <clears throat> you know, later in life, uh, taking care of uh, a family as best I could, being a rescue person, a fireman, uh, a little bit of being a forest fire uh, uh, ranger. Um, I enjoyed all that. You know, I really, and wouldn't have it any other way. And then, you know, just just doing my best to raise my kids and uh, be a good husband. And, well, now here, uh, oh, being a volunteer. But, you know, a lot of folks don't realize, but much of my radio career, I was a volunteer. Um, I worked... Um, for a college station and did what I could to, uh, with their great signal, I did my best to get people entertained, people that might otherwise not be entertained. I, I, hopefully I made them a little happier and didn't get a penny for that, but I got to say, I enjoyed it. Uh, the, um, and of course now the supermarket doing what I can these past, what, almost 15 years now, um, trying to keep people, uh, doing what I can to keep the the food on the uh, on their tables. It's and it's like I said, it's not easy. We move tons of product each day, and it's uh, it's a chore. You got to really 
you got to really hustle or the uh, the food runs low. It's um, and and again, I'll be getting up tomorrow. I think I think I have to get up at three thirty tomorrow. Three thirty. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think I do. <laughs> It's four thirty. Is going to feel like sleeping in after a while, and uh, you know, we'll it probably be a seven or eight hour day, and a long drive home, trying to keep my eyes open. Uh, so, uh, all in all, I got to say, and my fellow coworkers, oh, sure, we gripe a bit here and there, but well, who doesn't, right? Who the heck doesn't? And uh, we're, um, I, I think they're all a pretty much a good crew, and uh, we've. Uh, I, I'm I'm honored to be part of their scene. In any case, I just thought you might like uh, to hear you know the ramblings of a guy who does actually enjoy doing what I can to help other people out. I would suggest you give it a whirl too. You're gonna like gonna like yourself when you can do that kind of thing. Of course, sometimes you you're gonna sit like this and just go oh, with your uh, yeah with your elbow on the on the table and your your uh, cheek in your in your palm. Going, uh. <laughs> but that's all right. You'll manage, okay? I just thought I'd say, um, yeah, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, the glory forever. So be it. Okay. Yeah, friends, my advice to you, you want to be, um, you want to get a little uh, grin on your face, figure out some way you can serve, some way where you can help and you don't worry about whether there's money involved. Just figure it out and, uh, and then do it. And honestly, you'll be a bit happier for it. You'll certainly be amongst good people. Okay. Just thought I'd say, I'll see you later. Thank you. And well, God bless. <laughs>